How's it going everybody? So today is just a quick little um, upgrade. This is my paper tuner as you can tell. Um, without this, this is just, just a couple pieces of tape at the top, a couple pieces of tape at the bottom. We made this thing in like five minutes, just a bunch of scrap wood. Um, it worked great in the beginning. Like, I mean, look at it, it's pretty cool. Got it, it has to be put on a table, which kind of sucks, but I mean, it's a, it's a good, it's a good little starter. After a while, especially when I was tuning on my PSC, when I had underspined arrows, I was just going through paper after paper, trying to change my grip, twist, untwist, shim, just go back and forth, which became a nightmare. And doing my bows and my friend's bows, and I got a couple other guys who just getting into archery, working on their bows, having to like cut out measure a piece of paper then cut it then tape it and then tape it and then shoot that piece of paper a bunch and then measure it out it started to get really annoying so i came up with this idea i was actually gonna put um old school paper towel holders with like a dowel in the middle or like a um, kind of like a toilet paper roll but it's bigger um my mom actually came up with the idea and if i get uh, curtain rod holders. So these are actually curtain rod holders from Amazon. This is craft paper from Lowe's. And then I just had some extra P PVC pipe laying around and they actually screw in. So to tighten this, so it doesn't move and you just want this to roll. You just got to screw in these two little Two little screws that takes the Allen key. It actually comes with the Allen key or Allen wrench, um, which is pretty cool. But now, now all I have to do is just take the paper, roll it down, tape, 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 and we're good. So I don't know if people are having ideas of how to how to um, make a paper tuner something easy my next goal is to make longer legs is just to be able to grab the paper tuner put it in front of the target and just start shooting kind of gotta it sucks i gotta go grab a table and then stack a couple boxes on underneath the paper tuner to get it level shoot it up i like the paper tune level i know people paper tune like this facing down i don't know I just, it feels easier to paper tune level. It just takes a little bit more time, but I thought it was a pretty cool idea to get these curtain rod holders. This is not my favorite paper. It's a good paper. It's, it's about, it's about as thick as this. This is regular wrapping paper. This is called, it's called craft paper or masking paper. I'm gonna try it out first. If I don't like it, I can always just give it to my son and have them color on it and stuff. Spread it out on t uh, tables and let them paint away, let them paint away. So first I'm just gonna, it is a nice piece of paper, but for this sake, I just, get rid of this paper that way I had some limb problems with my PSC it started to splinter up at the top of the left limb I've done limbs before my Matthews I've actually done the limbs on my PSC shimming the cams over I did not feel like doing that again so I actually sent it to the bow bow and arrow shop Southern California Awesome guys. They actually built the bow. They took limbs off a 32, 70 pound 32 EVO and then put it on my 34. I guess they called their rep and they said it all it's all good. You can do that. I don't know if I'm supposed to say this, but that's what they did. And it worked great. And I, I, I don't know. It just started to have some little bit of splinters. So 
it's kind of a bummer but yeah that happened so I actually uh oh of course that would happen one second let me go grab that Gosh, we're dropping everything. So first, I just had, had a little paint. Um, what's it called? Um, paint pens. I got a bunch of, a couple of paint pens. Marked up where I want the holes to be. So... And instead of having to, I don't know if this is going to work. I'm going to try it out. And if it doesn't work, then I'll just move these. Instead of having these like right here and the roll being so big that the paper actually goes back and then comes down. My goal is to have it back here. So there's tension from the top of the roll touching this and then all the way down to there. So there's like tension going through throughout the whole paper and not just... I don't know. I don't know if that I'm making any sense, but so what we're gonna do is screw these bad boys in. And let's try that again. One second. See, this is a little screw that can tighten up the rods if you need them to get tightened. Okay. Let's try this again. I don't know if this is gonna work. I might have to hand screw these things in, which would suck. The angle that I'm getting at is it the best. That worked going in crooked but that's fine as long as it's going in I'll be okay let me get the back side perfect time to get this side take off the little allen line it up Okay, let's see how this works. Let's see if this works. So, I'm gonna take off this paper. I'm gonna take off this sticker. Perfect. 
There we go. That's the new paper tuner. Rolls easy. So now all I gotta do, I'll shoot a bunch of tears in it. Okay, just slide it down. Tape right there. Put a tape in the middle. Tape in the middle. Tape right there. Tape right there. We're good. So I kind of, I wanted this angle. I didn't want this roll to be over here. I wanted it to be like that. So it has like that tension. There we go. I'm a better visual explainer, but yeah. Uh, I was a full 360, but first upgrade complete. Next, figuring out how to make the legs longer. If any, anybody got ideas, let me know. I might maybe drill in some PVC pipe to it, make it longer. It'd be cool if I could build some PVC pipe and like extend it and close it. Or maybe it's like some, uh, what is it called? Like those metal rods where you push in and it goes to different holes. Just an idea. But yeah, if anybody's looking for an easy paper tuner, this thing is, I think this is 20 by 21 or 21 by 20. And we just put, some of those and then tightens it to there it's pretty easy and i know people cut out regular like like boxes which is smart and just tape a piece of paper but if you're looking for something that's a little bit more i guess permanent it's not a bad idea um yeah that's pretty much it if anybody got any ideas on how to make my legs or longer any any suggestions that'd be helpful um but yeah that's pretty much it like comment subscribe let me know what you think if it's a cool idea if not maybe i can try to rebuild another one but uh i got some cool little things on the way and uh yeah Stay tuned. Have a good one.